Okay, we have our actuator put back together. But now you notice our gate's not closing all the way. So what we want to do, we have our actuator turned upside down. So you have access, easy access to your two limit screws. Now, first of all, wherever your limits currently are, in the closed position and the open position, you want to get the gate in the middle. So just use your open button here. And then we'll just stop it approximately in the middle. Not perfectly, but somewhere in between where it's currently at. Now, this says extension limit and retraction limit. You may not be able to see it because of the shadow, but extension and retraction. So we need to extend the close limit. So we were off about a foot or so, so we'll turn it about five turns counter clock or clockwise. One, two, three, four, five. Now we'll let it cycle. And then we want to cycle it open before we make any other adjustment. So whenever you push that button and if it closes, we want to open it back up and then close it all the way just to see where we're landing at. And with a double gate, just do one side at a time. It takes 30 or 40 minutes, but it's worth it. Rather than trying to do two gates at one time, we get one where we want it, then we'll work on the second one. Okay, again, we're setting the extension limit only, which is right here. Extension, increase, extend length. Go clockwise. If it was too far closed, we would want it, we would want to go counterclockwise with this screw. So this is the only screw that you use for the extension. Okay, we want to do it. Let's let's go ten times. Three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10. And those are probably only half turns. But once you begin to get close, then you'll just do it one or two turns. See, we're almost there. We'll press the button. You want to open it all the way just so that limit can run all the way down that screw. Just, uh, to be sure it's going to be where we want it. Let's see where we're going to be at here. Almost there. I'll put it back in the halfway position and probably give it five more turns but that's how you adjust the extended limit.